it's Lion here and today I'm blending in with this bench but today is the first of the month which means it's time for another Lego City update I can't believe it's already been another month time flies speaking of which it looks like I've got a helicopter over there you may have seen in my Lego haul I just got two new stack ons so I was sort of going through my stuff and I found this I decided to put it on top of my uh, police station for now I do plan on rebuilding this um, fairly fairly soon I'm not sure when I'm really gonna do it but basically I'm not that pleased with how this came out and um, it was pretty well received but it wasn't as well received as the last one just because I feel like this one's a bit boring it's a bit flat a bit of a box and um, it kind of feels too big especially for its height so I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut off a 16 base plate size and then put that on top and um, obviously change the whole design as well but yeah that's hopefully gonna get changed up soon which will mean that this 48 stud gap over here will eventually be two base plates and that means I'll be adding some new modulars over in this area but this thing over here has completely fallen apart um yeah over in this area I've also got a dude over here and he is just exploring the only wild area of my city at the moment I kind of built this as a filler but I've really sort of turned to love this place so I think I'll be trying to add areas like this into my city um after i've rearranged everything as well but i've also got my horses here and my cherry tree and at the very back there you'll see that i've added in these fences and that's just to make it look more realistic so that people don't especially the horses don't walk onto the tracks but it looks like i've also got a spooky dude over there as well over in this area you'll see that there's been a discovery on the beach it looks like some crazy brain dude here has washed up ashore and um it's a very hot subject in my city at the moment not many things happen so I've got a super quarantine guy, some police officers and my detective over here checking out what's going on. And if you see just behind him, I've actually added a couple of little rocks. I figured that was a really good idea and also maybe extending out sort of bottoms of the cliff to sort of reach out a bit and then have a bit of rocks around them. It kind of look more realistic because you get that on beaches, you know, you do get pebbles. Um, but when I do redo this area, I'll definitely consider that. In the last update, I did say that I was going to hopefully try and work on the base of this get the tunnel finished and all sorts of stuff along with the post office over there that i'm going to rebuild uh, because it's horrible <laughs> but i didn't get to doing that i haven't bought anything lately except for that stack on i'm kind of holding back on that just trying to figure out what i actually want to build because i originally had a design for that and then i thought about buying the parts for it and it kind of ended up being too expensive so I was just sort of thinking about other designs and I found one that I think I'm going to do. So yeah, at the moment I'm just holding back. I could just buy the pieces for that tunnel and finish that. Same with sort of the base for this. But I kind of want to buy it all at the same time so that it's cheaper and you don't have to pay for loads of deliveries. So yeah, that's basically all held back at the moment. Um, over here you'll also see that I've got this. <laughs> that hasn't been finished yet. I hopefully should get those greens along with the rest. But over here I do have a pirate. And he's got the whole lot. He's got the hat, the sword, the gun and everything. And it looks like he's shooting down at this dude over here who's fishing. And I've also got another little boat here with a frog in it. <laughs> but yeah, that's pretty much the beach area. I do hope on adding some really cool features to that in the future. But generally throughout the city, not a lot else has changed. I was just trying to film something in this area, but I ended up flattening that, knocking the palm tree over and destroying that tree. So hopefully this time I don't do that. Basically, I've got my minifigure series bat minifigure back there. I think that's pretty cool uh, as he's sort of hanging around with the other bats on that tree. Haven't built any more trees lately just because um, I haven't really got the leaves. I do want to get a lot more of those. But I do have that style of tree over there. I'd like to build a couple more of those, but I don't have the bricks to go in the middle of it. Uh, but yeah, hopefully I should get this tunnel finished soon as well. I think it looks really nice. I was considering building it over on the other side, but you can't really see that tunnel. So I figured I probably just won't do that. Over here by the Cafe Leo, it looks like I've got my snake charmer. But um, if you want to see a review on this, there'll be a card on screen. I think it's a really awesome modular, along with my train station, which is also probably one of my best builds ever. Uh, but yeah, I do plan on building another skyscraper very soon. I've actually already built it, kind of, in multicoloured. So I just need to buy the right colours. But as you can imagine, it's pretty pricey, it's a lot more detailed than the Cafe Leo. And it should be, from there, about the same height up to there. And uh, yeah, I think it will look really cool. So along with that, I also want to do the 
police station like I mentioned. I want to do the post office at the very back there along with a lot of these random buildings here. I kind of want to rebuild some of those into some custom mocks that look a lot better. But that's pretty much it for this update. I haven't got a lot of changes because I've been making lots of other different videos. You may have seen my top 10 building ideas so I've been coming up with lots of ideas for those and then I've also got custom motorbikes and stuff that I've made and speaking of which recently I have made another motorbike and here it is it's a really nice motorbike and I wanted to put this into the city but I was like where on earth can I put it I looked around for a while and I kind of noticed that there's no really parking spaces at all I don't want to build one of those big car park blocks but I figured maybe in an area over there it'd be a good place to actually put some car parks but yeah that's basically my thoughts for this city for now now I'm going to go ahead and show you the train, the monorail and the ferris wheel running and that will pretty much wrap up today's video so thanks for watching and I'll see you next time